Hey y'all, welcome back to Let's Play E6, Ark of Napishtim. Last time we took our care of everything we needed to before the final boss. This time, let me show off my inventory real quick. I bought five Seeds of Vitality because I had 100,000 GF for the grinding session. Also, all your swords should be max level. And then you're gonna, so next thing you wanna do is head up this way. A vast empty space spread out before Adol's eyes, and a huge jetpack structure can be seen in the distance. Reaching it on foot would be impossible. This is called Wavern's Cor Corridor. It's, it's said that Alma crossed it when she went to seal the Ark long ago. Forgive me, Adol. I've been following you since you left the village, though I do have good reason. If you truly intend to proceed any further, you're going to need the help of a priestess of Alma, after all. This particular role of ours is only known to us priestesses. Even the village chief isn't aware of it. At all, you, you're really going to three with this, aren't you? Thank you. I leave Isha's capable in your capable hands. And while I cannot go at your side, I will do what I can in order to light your path. Nice. Once you've crossed over the Ark, returning here won't be an easy task. You won't have a way to temper your sword either. Are you certain you're ready? I'm ready. He was created by men with wicked hearts, but Alma granted him salvation and made him her servant. Add all this is for you. The Mirror of Zim. Name both my mother and the priestess before the beast. Keep it with you for good luck. Just in time. Oh, it's you. Sorry, but I'm coming along for the ride. Seems like this is the only way to get inside the Ark. It appears that you two have the right to enter the Ark. Take care of both of you. Thanks, I owe you one. You cannot return back there from this point. You might have already figured out most of it on your own. But either way, I'm a descendant of those idiots who stole the Black Key from Alma in the first place. And that bastard who received the Ark, Commander Ernst, is my older brother. Ever since he stole the Black Key, he's been dead on set on finishing what our ancestors started. From And from calling those fairies related to the three ML swords to dispat, dissipate the Great Vortex, to punish Aragus and his soldiers into finding those of the priestess bloodline. Everything's gone exactly how he wanted it to. I jumped into the great vortex hoping to screw up his plan before he could pull it off, but well, you can see how that's been going. I haven't been able to do a damn thing to stop him. But I'm not gonna give up that easily. It's not too late. There has to be something I can do. Ugh, can't say this in this, the smoothest ride I've ever been on. We're near the end, though. The arc's just up ahead. Yeah, I'd probably get frickin' motion sick. I had no idea controlling the wyvern would be this difficult. I still have a long way to go as a priestess. But I have finally managed to fill my duty. Alma, mother, please keep him safe from harm. All right. There is a chest there. 
That is the last chest in the game, I believe. This looks like the entrance. There's no telling what kind of snakes they've got lying in wait here. But anyway, there's no going back now. Let's get going. Oh yeah! Before taking on the Ark of Napishtim, change your equipment up. You do not need the Starlight Medallion anymore. Switch to the Defense Immolus. You do not- you need that. Okay. I need one more item. I will not equip the Daylight Stone until I am facing the final boss. And there are still two bosses left. I'm going to put that in there. I'm going to use this. Uh, you'll obtain a Seat of Power right here. That is the last one in the game. Uh, go ahead and use that. Right here. Going to recommend saving on slot 16. Since there's no going back. Huh, so the legends were true. The password to activate this is, I may leave you, but I return to paradise. Dang. Looks like there's only room for one. Sorry, but I'm going first. You're an alright guy in my book now, but clearing up my family's mess is something only I can do. Fair enough. So, here we go. First boss. Of the final dungeon. This guy looks kind of familiar. However, unlike the original one, he's not too difficult. And with our flame sword, he shouldn't be too much of an issue at all. I'm just enduring, right? I'm just tanking it at this point. Of course, he's got a second form. Because, you know, we can't make this too easy, can we? Not that I would mind. Jesus Christ. But considering I'm all up to date and upgraded, I should be fine. That takes care of that. And the elevator will return. Yeah. Gonna go ahead and operate the device. Head up. And up here. Up here. Another chest. Which includes a copla water. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and equip my blue potions for now. Go ahead and save again at the Ark Throne. And right out here, you'll find geese. He lost. Heh, I almost thought you weren't coming. What took you so long? Add all mention the long monster that appeared after geese left. That must have been the original god, but Len, that sank the Roman fleet. My ancestors made it out in the Nash, and then out of and out of Ash Emulus using the technology they stole from the winged people. Ha ha! You never cease to amaze, do you? 
And just look at me. I'm a disgrace. I thought I could take my brother on, but I didn't stand a chance against the Black Key. He might even be stronger than Alma was when she sealed the Ark away. Watch out. He's fainted. Yep. The throne floor. Nice. Are you sure you don't want to finish him off, Master Ernst? He may be your brother, but I'm on the opinion that he's far too dangerous to be left alive. I quite agree. We would be happy to take care of him for you, if you so please, if it so pleases you. Heh. <laughs> you needn't concern yourself with him. Besides, we have a new guest to attend to. Guest? Welcome, Adol Christian. I was hoping that I would have the chance to meet you. My foolish brother owes quite a debt of gratitude to you from what I hear. And I must say, I've taken great interest in you, your many exploits. Ernst Salceda, Asteria Salceda, Felgana, Flandria. No, I've only let's played one of those, and I'm not doing the final one anytime soon. I've used the Roman Intelligence Network to research all that you did in each of those regions. I'm fascinated by how deeply you've managed to involve yourself with the mysteries of the Elden. And what a fascinating civilization they were. The Elden civilization prospered on the fabled continent of Atlas, and is the origin of both the kingdoms of East and Salceda. Thanks to the winged gods, Imelis technology, their kingdom reached unheard levels of prosperity. The potential of Imelis is nothing short of miraculous. I suspect many of the wonders you have encountered on your journey were created by the gods during the peak of the Elden civilization. The gods even used that limitless potential of Imelis to alter their own bodies. White Imelis can be crafted into any form and bestowed its barrier to the powers manipulating the essence of life itself. The power of white Imelis allows them to obtain miraculous abilities and even immortality. When a winged god left our world, his or her wings burn body turned to the statue of the purest white. Inspired by this, our ancestors attempted to use the power of the Ark to create white Imelis themselves. But alas, all they were able to create was Ash Emilus, a crude, unstable substitute. This is the Black Key, Almarine, Almarian, the master key to the Ark, created by Alma and stolen from her by my ancestors. Alas, achieving complete control of it is impossible with the body of a mere mortal but that limitation can easily be circumvented by using a priestess who has inherited the blessing of Alma. <laughs> ha ha ha, finally it is mine. The power to create miracles once possessed only by the gods the Black Wings of Omnipotence. Take up your sword, add all the red. Fall to a power beyond the gods. Whoa, it's Dark Facts theme. Kinda. Ernst. Pretty freaking... If you're not prepared for this boss, this boss is really freaking hard. Luckily, I am prepared for this boss. One thing to note about him. Is he can heal. Thanks to the fairies.
but without much issue, I did take him out just fine. Impossible. I was supposed to have become a god. How could I possibly lose? Master Ernst, I'm so tired. I'm ashamed I can no longer be of any service to you, Master Ernst. Mm. At all. You came for me. I knew you would. I was having a nightmare, but I wasn't scared at all. Because I knew, I knew you'd come and save me. Wait. This isn't over. I will not be defeated like this. You really don't know when to give up, do you? Guys, he came here as Alma's representative, and you lost to him fair and square. Just just stop this already. You don't need to be part of our ancestors' crazy delusions anymore. Heh, <laughs> you little fool. I have no intention of listening to a man who brought nothing but shame to his people. Ernst, our ancestors opened the lid of the Forbidden Ark in order to obtain the power of the gods. And a thousand years after they failed, the chance to do what they could not lies in front of their descendants. Me. I have only one choice. I, the master of the Black Key, command you, Great Ark of Napishtim, heed my words. Bestowed upon your limitless power. Ha ha ha. More, more. I can feel the power flowing through me. With the Ark under my command, I can surpass even the gods. Well, what's happening? That's not a good idea. Yeah. Ernst. Master Ernst. <laughs> it seems that my final waker ended in failure. Descendant lost control of key function. Detecting lost control of key function. Detecting lost of control key functionality. Switching to automatic control. What, what the? So the worst came to be after all. At this rate, not only these islands, but the whole estate or Rygian continent will be destroyed. What, what the hell are you talking about? The Ark of Napishtin was designed by a, a weather control mechanism created by the to protect the Elden civilization. However, our ancestors attempted to use that for their own personal gain, resulting in it going out of control. In East and Celceta as well, the successors of Elden have fallen to our root to ruin. And now, the Ark intends to revive what has been lost. I suspect it will create a giant tsunami, and with it, destroy the civilizations that dare impede its ambitions. In other words, the nations that have since taken root in the constant continent of Eurasia. I had attempted to find a way to control it in order to atone for the mistake of our ancestors. I see now that I was simply unworthy of doing so. You gotta be kidding me. So you're saying that you, all along, you... <laughs> don't misunderstand. I would not deny that I sought power. My soul longed for the power of the White Wings. I do not regret those desires of mine. But it was not my intention to lead the realm to ruin. Ruin. The path to the Ark is known the Ark's core. The sacrament floor has opened. At all, Christian, using the three keys that you possess, if luck is on your side, you may yet be able to start the Ark. Ah, uh, God. Jusu, Sarah, Zisa, you have my thanks for serving me so loyally all this time. This this is my final order. Go with Geese, accompanying him as you have me. Geese, forgive me for being such a burden as a brother. Farewell. Master Ernst, no, this cannot be happening. No, no, Master Ernst, you can't just... You idiot. Looks like this is it. At all, Christian? I hate to admit it, but it looks like you're the only one who can stop the Ark now. Please go right my brother's wrongs. No, don't go. Don't go. I have a really bad feeling about this. If you go, I feel like I'm going to be able to see you again. So, so if you really want to go, then please take me with you. Bah. No, let me go. Leave the kid to me. I'll take her somewhere safe. Even if it costs me my life. 
What are you three doing? Come on, we're not listen weren't you listening to what your my brother said? Right, true. That's what Master Ernst final orders. Very well, Master Ernst. No, let me go. At all, at all. Alright. I say go ahead and equip the daylight stone. Switch this out for cop blow water. This is gonna be a really long video, I'm telling you guys that right now. Most of my finals are. Up here. The Sacramentus floor. I am Napish Tim, a weather control mechanism tasked with regulating the whole at of the Atlas Ocean. After Alma sealed me away, I slept a shallow sleep, and I dreamed. I dreamed the twilight of a mighty Elden, and a su successor taking root in the Ernst Ocean, of an ocean. But now, a thousand years hence, the dreams have been shattered. The spirit of the Elden that drove and shaped their development is all but gone from the land of Asteria, Eurasia. The false civilization must perish. To take on Napishtim. Every time you see one of these things passing by, use the sword of the color. I want to use red. Keep using red. Blue. That should deactivate the blue lasers. Or so I thought. Okay. Yellow. Use a couple of water. Completing establishment of water wall. Probability of erasing west coast normal. Initiating final phase. Here we are. The final phase. Don't know. That target right there is what you want to aim for. This boss isn't, again, don't let yourself get caught up in lasers because that seems to be a cause of death, a regular cause of death. Luckily, I got the, uh...
Come on. Hit it. I am not doing too well. Okay, let's get up. See if I can... Got him. Right before I died, too. I don't know if I'd used the bell or not. I don't think I did. But we'll see. I mean, we won't see because I beat the game. The Ark of Napishtim is crumbling. This isn't good. We need to... St hey, you with the black hair. You're serious about Adol being in that thing? Yeah. I'm sorry if I hadn't asked him. He... Why? Why does this always happen? Why does always always happen to everything dangerous? Ah. Oh, look at that. It's so pretty. Unbelievable. Oh, what could those wings be? Yeah. Alma, my mother, and the other priestesses. The calm, gentle sea stretched out onto the horizon and beyond. The great vortex and the water walls were no more. Hey, Adol. Adol. You idiot. When are you going to stop making people worry about you? Adol, Adol. Yeah, that was a good game. Um, so things happen now that the let's play is over. Let's just go on talking about what's next, I guess. As hint, though, it's probably gonna like show up literally Monday. Um, I've mentioned I'm doing a Game Boy Advance game, a game originally for Game Boy Advance. I'm playing it on my Wii U. Let's mention that right now. Uh, the other hint I'm going to give is it is a JRPG, and there are three games in the franchise, though only I th only think two of them are good. 
And, uh, I guess the other hint I can give is I wanted this character in Smash Bros. as a playable character, but he is an assist trophy. So, yeah, that's a thing. Anything else I want to focus on? There will be a bonus video for this at some point, because I still have that super boss to take on, but I did a test run before I recorded this video, and it is not possible to beat it at this time. So I will not be tackling it. Isha ran off because she's sad. Yes. Well, I'm going to tell you guys something. We probably haven't seen the last of him. But that'll be a while from now. In terms of next East game I'm going to do, um, Oath and Felga Anna would probably be next. Uh, that won't be for a few projects, though. But I intend to keep this series going. But Oath and Hogahana takes place before this game. In fact, so... Kind of be seeing a prequel-like game. I guess some of these people just want to stick around here. Can't really blame them. And anything else? Um... I don't know. Um, I, this is actually a question, though I don't know if it really is something anyone would be interested in. In the PS2 version of this game, there's this thing called the Trials of Ama. I would have to complete another playthrough on the PS2 version, and I don't like the PS2 version because it's really freaking ugly. It looks really bad, like ugly character models and stuff. Oh. She's waving. That's cute. And she's crying. That's sad. I like Isha. She's a good child. As I say, though, on the PS2 version, there are these things called the Trials of Alma. And if anyone is interested, I will complete a playthrough of the PS2 version. I will get myself a converter with my capture card, and I will take it on. The karmic void text that had swallowed so many fates with its mighty power it was no more. A clear blue sky was, and deep blue sea spread out across the horizon. A whole new world was beginning to emerge, and Adol, as always, was ready to set off on yet another adventure. East 6, the Ark of Napishtim, end. Nice. Well, if you beat the game, like every other East game, you unlock a boss rush mode. Um... I don't feel like doing that right now, or at all. Um, so yeah, I'm going to end off the video here. Um, I'll see you guys for my next Let's Play.